there are, I mean, teams that lost a lot of money. And, you know, as a business, I'm sure that goes into, you know, the thought process behind any decisions moving forward, especially with some uncertainty for this coming season. In this particular case, you want to be careful not to overthink it. And you also want to have respect for the process, right? So I'll deal with the respect for the process first. DJ LeMay is a free agent. The Yankees obviously want him back. They're not trying to be so coy that they're not saying that, right? They're openly saying, Brian Cashman yeah. saying, he's our number one priority. We're trying to get it done. And that is them trying to show the respect for a player they want, right? They're not, they're not looking to anger him. They're just also not looking to pay money that no one else is going to pay just for the sake of it, right? They're not looking to pay a Yankee tax because they're the Yankees and they can afford it, right? They're looking to pay what this current market is dictating. Um, and I don't think there's anything wrong with them going about it that way um, and, and trying to get a feel for the landscape. Having said that, I also think you want to, at the same time, be careful that you don't lose him because losing him would be a massive mistake. Now, I've seen people try and justify like, well, you know, if you ended up trading for Francisco Lindor, then it's OK. No, it's not OK. <laughs> it's not OK to lose DJ LeMahieu. DJ LeMahieu has been the best player on the New York Yankees for two straight seasons. This is a team that wants to win a championship. The reason you've allocated the money you have to Garrett Cole is to win a title. Mm -hmm. If you take away DJ LeMahieu, your chances of winning a title go down significantly. And now all of a sudden that investment in Garrett Cole is not as significant a one as it should be, right? Because you've given him a much worse chance of winning a championship. This is a guy who is a plus at three defensive positions who literally fits in perfectly with the culture with the atmosphere, with the grind in New York, the media, the, the pressure of playing in New York, the October moments, hitting good pitching, the ballpark. You know, this guy, I apologize for the sirens. Here. All good. It they, adds to the they, drama, man. This is yeah, beautiful. They, they want DJ LeMay. <laughs> you know, like, he's the perfect Yankee, and he's perfect for this team right now. So you can't lose him. Period. The end, you can't lose him. But I understand doing everything you can until it gets to that point of trying to get him at your best price. So walk that line. And at the end of the day, do what you have to do to get him because losing him would be a big mistake that you will end up trying to make up for in ways that won't be as efficient as just cutting him whatever check you have to.